Good morning and welcome to the Morning Touch. I'm Darwin Campbell with FSBC, Sorrel Ranch in Glendale, bringing you the message for today. The message for today is simple. In, in light of all the latest uh, news that we received about the COVID-19 virus, I want to share with you some powerful information from the Apostle Paul in Romans chapter 8. There Paul says, in all things we're more than conquerors, starting with verse 37 of chapter 8. Through him who loved us, for I am convinced that neither death nor life, neither angels nor demons, nor things present nor things in the future, nor any powers, neither height nor depth, nor any such thing in all else of creation will be able to separate us from the love of God that is in Christ Jesus the Lord. My friends, today, in light of the negative news and the negative situations that people find themselves in with COVID-19, I want you to be encouraged. Paul said, no matter what condition or situation that I find myself in, absolutely nothing can separate me from the love of God in Christ Jesus. Amen. And he lists a number of things that, that we go through. Now we're going through the pandemic, but Paul says, not life, not death, not disease, not hurricane, not money problems, not anything bringing it into our terms can separate us. Paul says absolutely nothing can make me walk away from God. Nothing can make me walk away from Jesus Christ because the promise is too great. The promise is too good. The promise is too eternal. The words for the day is that these are powerful words in tough times. Romans chapter 8 verses 37 through 39 are powerful words that you need to put in your pocket, that you need to memorize because they are powerful words for tough times. They are confident words in difficult circumstances and it gives you a full assurance that there is a great day of relief coming. There is a great day of relief coming. Yeah. And Paul says, I will not trade that great day of relief for anything. Yes. The promise is great. The promise is eternal. The promise is worth fighting for. It's worth walking through the fog. It's worth dealing with the pandemic because the promise is real and it's true. Let me tell you something. Yes. You may be grieved by the death of a loved one. You may be challenged uh, by an empty food cupboard. You may be shortchanged because you're unemployed. You may be bowled over by your bills. You may be swept up in a full sea of hopelessness. Yes. But as you tread the water in that sea, remember the promises of God. Amen. They are true. They are just. They are righteous. They will come to pass. Yes. There is relief from this sea of hopelessness. Thank you, there is relief from the grief. There is relief from the challenge. There is relief from being bowled over. You see, Satan's goal is to break you down, to wear you out, to make you quit, to kill your faith. That's yes. what the devil is doing in this crisis. But I'm telling you, be like the Apostle Paul. Do not allow the devil to steal your joy. Yes. He says, no matter what happens in my life, no matter what I go through, no matter what I'm dealing with, he says, nothing will separate me from the love of God in Christ Jesus. Yes. So my friends, Romans 8 is the right message for you today. Romans 8 is the right word for you today, that no matter what is happening in your life, do not allow it to separate you from the love of God and Jesus Christ. Amen. Do not allow Satan to whisper lies into your ear and cause you to quit or give up. Romans 8 is for you, the love of God. So we encourage you today, stay focused, stay on course, stay committed, stay on track. Do not give up because heaven will truly and surely be worth it all. Amen. God bless you. You know, the Morning Touch is brought to you by the First Southern Baptist Church in Sorrel Ranch in Glendale. We are certainly glad to be able to bring this to you, and we hope that it builds you up and encourages you.
Do not let nothing separate you from the love of Jesus Christ. God bless you and keep you. And we'll see you again next time on The Morning Touch.